welcome for another alternative scenario ASMR session ASMR session well the subject for today is what if the Roman Empire would have survived until the present day we're going to analyze some possible scenarios and outcomes. But uh, the scenario of the Roman Empire never falling until present day, it's pure hypothetical. It's like with far reaching implication, political implications, social implications, and also the relations with the developed Western civilizations but uh, it will be nice let's speculate a little bit for this we need something else let's have a look over the map and see how the Roman Empire could expand and what could became until present day good and first let's have a look over the roman empire at its peak it was expanded almost all across europe that we are knowing today and northern africa and Middle East, so expansion and stability, this will be a fact. Without experiencing the fall of the Western Roman Empire in 476 AD, then the Roman Empire will likely continue its expansion, consolidation of power across Europe and North Africa and Middle East. This will lead to further stability and cultural assimilation within the borders. So we have some eventually some expansion during time right but you know that in 476 AD the Roman Empire had split it into the Eastern which was became the Byzantine Empire and the Western Roman Empire but eliminating this if not influences and language well an important alternative fact is that the latin language will remain the dominant language across europe so latin language dominate across Europe serving as lingua franca for trade, governance and education. Also the Roman culture will spread across its border over its border influencing the neighbors. So we have Roman culture. Roman law and Roman art. This will reshape the this had, will had reshaped the social facts of a kingdom from Europe and Western civilization. Another 
possible outcome will be centralized authority. We know that Roman Empire put the base of centralized form of government. This will, pers this will persist inside its Roman Empire until today, but also it will be a model for the neighboring kingdoms with strong imperial rule and bureaucracy overseeing various provinces and territories. But this was led to a unified political structure and a greater stability. Continue innovations. Of course, the Roman Empire was known for its engineering feats and technological advancement. And this advancement will be models for kingdom to come and for the entire world. Without its decline, these developments will likely fostering further progress in medicine, infrastructure and urban planning. So we have continue uh, innovations. But what would happen with the uh, other civilization? Well, encounters with the Eastern powers, the Roman Empire would continue to interact with Byzantine Empire and powerful civilizations in the East, such as Caliphates, Islamic, Islamic Caliphates. This interaction will shape trade routes, diplomacy and cultural exchange. But what is next step? Exploration and colonization. Well, we know that the beautiful Roman Empire had vast access to military resources and strength, and the Roman Empire might venture to the future, to the uncharted territories, that will mean exploring the west, across the seas, and the east, and establishing new colonies, new colonies, this is very important, new colonies in new lands, these colonies will have a good interactions with the neighbors, making it a stronger empire of its world. This will lead to encounters with indigenous people and spread the Roman influence and religion, the Christianity. But also this was an ideal, a new topic outcome. But what if challenges and potential decline. Yes, we need to take this in account because during the Middle Eve there were a lot of kingdom disputes or disputes between kingdoms across Europe. So internal struggles in that point. 
Roman Empire would face greater challenges. Despite its resilience, the Roman Empire will still face internal challenges such as political intrigue, corruption and disparities. And over time, these factors would weaken the empire from its potential. And even to fragmentation or decline. All right, so we have a few possible scenarios, but what out? What about external threats? External threats like barbarian invasions and external pressure will continue to pose threats to the Roman Empire stability. Without experiencing significant setbacks, the Empire might develop strategies to repeal this, and let's assume it would. Okay, and now let's launch some hypotheses. Well, possible scenarios first. Continued expansions without a fall, the Roman Empire will dominate the entire Europe, North Africa and Middle East. And this will led in a very strong country, let's say, because it will become the strongest state in this area in Northern Africa and in, uh, in Europe. The strongest state in terms of military, in terms of culture, social, and social status and trade. But also, let's see uh, another possible scenario. Evolution of the Roman society with its stability preserved as a local power. The Roman society may have continued to evolve, evolve. continue to evolve, incorporating new ideas, technologies and culture from other empires. This could lead to a more diverse cosmopolitan Roman Empire. Religious landscape. The Roman Empire we know that played a significant role in the spread of Christianity. The spread. Well, without its fall, the development and spread of the Christianity could have been shaped differently potentially influencing the religious landscape of Northern Africa and Middle East. And let's presume that the Roman Empire will survive until today. It's, it will interact with various civilizations during time like Persian Empire, Chinese dynasties, and Indian Kingdom. Without its fall, this interaction could have continued and evolved, shaping the course of world history, and more important, its global influence. A Roman Empire that never fell, could have had lasting impact on global geopolitics. 
job politics <laughs> with its influence extending far beyond Europe trade routes cultural exchange diplomatic relations could make a very strong empire around the world and one of the most powerful states around the world but let's take in account another possible scenario alternatively if the roman empire did eventually decline not fall decline may have been delayed or transformed in a gradual evolution rather than a dramatic collapse this will lead to a different post-Roman world. Well, if we can imagine the Roman Empire in present days, definitely it will be not an empire anymore. It will be today a powerful, the most powerful state in Europe that is so large and so expanded that will include the Mediterranean Sea as an internal sea. Overall, the scenario of the Roman Empire never falling. It offers a fascinating exploration of might have been and some sort of speculations on the potential history trajector at the conclusion if the Roman Empire never fell would result in a vastly different shape of Europe with continuing Roman influence shaping the course of history well into modern times the Roman Empire will become the Roman state or Roman kingdom or Republic of Romans. However, this is a very interesting theory. However, it's essential to remember that history is complex and alternative outcomes often led to unforeseen consequences and developments but that was the funny part of this session and i hope you enjoy this kind of video and thank you very much for watching until next time I wish you all the best. So we all we will be Roman Kingdom citizens.